Greetings, everyone, and welcome to an OTSL game against Ronnie Jeter. Uh, he is, uh, this is game 12 for me in the OTSL season, currently 8-3 uh, after a uh, thrilling game yesterday. Um, invite you to check it out if you haven't already against uh, Ka Chun Law. Uh, a little bit frustrating on both sides, um, but, uh, but a good game yesterday and hoping for uh, another good one today against Ronnie. And uh, so looking to get to looking to get to nine and three on the season, put myself in good shape for making the playoffs. But here we go. Uh, huh, okay, well, this is let's see what do we got here? Four, four, and uh, then yeah, you goes fine. Okay. Um, well, an interesting hand um you know no access card so i'll be able to get cia out relatively painlessly i would think um, i have korean war so i have to take south korea no access cards um cns is going to be my headline i've got five-year plan which is probably going to be my hold and i'm probably i'm gonna have to space marshal um not a great hand here but not a terrible one either Okay, let's, um, typical 4-4-2 setup. Okay, defectors is annoying. Okay, uh, well, let's start with the old Iran coup. Okay, that's a good roll, but we'll see if he coups back. I kind of don't want to eat a coup back. Okay, influence. Okay, goes Malaysia. Oh, we're already into France. Okay. So I don't think it's time to give up CIA just yet. Hold on to De Gaulle to plan to event him mid-turn, but I think if he's got Europe, he's got it, and I'm just going to deal with that. So let's block that off uh, and go into South Korea. See more and more of that Jordan play, as opposed to Egypt. Um, I know I'm going to have to give. C I'm obviously going to give CIA here, but I want to give it as late as possible because I'm going to be showing that I don't have any access cards. But I obviously have a five-year plan and Marshall in my hand. I have to deal with that. So I think the next play probably for Mosin to take Iran and put another one in South Korea. Korean War to take South Korea. Marshall to space uh, and then give CIA. Okay, he's going right for the coup. And that's that hurts. is fine okay um, that's a big roll let's beat him to space and miss that roll as well not a good start not a good start at all
Man, another four. Yep, gonna take Asia Dom. Well, if he has Asia, then he has it. I can't take South Korea without using the China card. Let's just give CIA and be done with it. Man, that was a huge, huge coup in Iran. Oof. Might coup a rock here just to lower DEFCON, in which case I'll take Lebanon. If he doesn't do that, I'll probably take Panama. Okay, that's kind of what I thought. Read C, because he doesn't want me to get Panama. I'll get Lebanon. <sighs> if he has Asia, he'll just score it here. Man, another four. Okay. I don't know why I said another four before. That's only, it's two fours for him and a four for me. Okay. Um, well. Let's do that. to potentially force a third in Pakistan. Yep, good play on his part. And we will use Korean War to Take South Korea. Oh boy, this is this was not a good turn one. Now I do have five year plan, so maybe I can five year plan a bad scoring. But an ugly, ugly start here. Man, that's a big op hand. Three, three, four, 10, 17, 19 ops played. All guilt free. The fates of totalitarian regimes are nurtured by misery and war. Okay, well, I got Europe. In the evil soil of poverty and strife. So, five year plan Europe is good. Uh, and because Defectors is gone, I can headline Decall, which is exactly what I'm going to do. Yeah. Okay, um, so clearly one there. And then I think these, because I'm giving up, I'm giving up a coup. I could do something like that, this, this, and this. And then if he coups, I get Angola. But then he'll just poke Thailand to go to Angola. I think this is fine. Oh, geez. I can't. Oh, my God. Well, I'm glad I realized it. I can't flip Thailand here. 
um, because uh, other, because then I can't five-year plan Europe. Although maybe I could event Suez, um, but there are two more purges. There are two more ops out there. Um, Let's do, uh, damn. Okay, we'll do this. Okay, we're clearly not eventing at war. Okay, do that. Now he's got to put another one in Thailand, and then we'll try and I, I'm gonna try and stop Asia Dom by take by with the IP war. Oh, I'm really, I almost made a really stupid mistake there. Special, man, all the blue cards have come out. Okay, yep, good play for him. Okay, it's time for me to get a good roll. That's a disaster. <sighs> okay. He should just score Asia if he has it. Again, I could use the China card to flip Pakistan. But I don't want to do that with five-year plan in Europe in hand. I could event Suez. Oh, okay. Romania. Gonna give me Romanian. Oh, that stops. Dom. Okay, now I could score Europe and hold five-year plan for, for potentially for Asia. But I also want to block off Algeria. And I kind of want the three ops. And I want to go to space, and I am going to go to space too. Okay, let's block off Algeria. Get to Zaire. All right, let's let's wait an action round because if he has Asia, then there's no point in holding five year plan for it. I don't think. Nasser. Okay, so he's going to just give me Egypt, but he's going to take Libya. Okay. All right. Well, now I think we can try space. Okay, hit the roll. Olympics. Okay, he's going to take back Dom. That's fine. Let's just take the battleground I have access to. Set up Middle East Dom. You know what else is known as has not been seen as socialist governments? Blockade, destall, all still around. Purge too. Let's 
Sock goes to space. Uh, and Truman is still unseen as well. What the heck do I do with these five-year plan ops? South Africa? Poke something? I don't really need to poke West Germany. I have access to France. I don't know what the heck I'm doing with what I do with this op. Second one in Angola to stop him from flipping it? Overprotect North Korea? If he wants to poke North Korea, he can kind of he can poke North Korea, but okay. Sure, let's do that. Okay, Asia purge NTB blockade D stall. I used Fidel. C five Vietnam still around. We are okay that's that's smart all right he has lots of countries in asia he has one two three four five six seven countries to my three okay i get asia oh i get both fours purge ntb asia and eeu he gets blockade, destall, Truman, C5, UN. Oh, and I redraw Europe. Jeez. Okay, well, I got Asia. Um, so the headline here has to be Purge. Um, we're just going to hope that he does not have defectors. A defectors redraw would be so bad because I'm going to give up so many VPs. Ah, that's another bad redraw. Okay. His ops are just terrible. But he does have Truman, so I can't do anything in Europe. How far do I coup with here? Am I just taking a Middle Eastern coup with NTB? Let's do EEU. All right, blockade, destall, Truman, C5, UN. This is, if I, if I take Japan, he can take Taiwan for Dom. So that's not great. Comic-Con gonna give me those influence right back. Okay, yeah, and he's, he's being preemptive about it.
Okay, blockade D-stall Truman, C5, UN. Uh, his hand is not good. I have nothing, I can't contest Asia. So I'm gonna try and just contest Europe instead. Wait, I don't need to take Libya, no, that's fine. I guess I could use NTB to take check in Greece. Might actually be the play. Okay, there's blockade with D stall. Okay, well now Suez is useless. So if I do this, and this, gives me six countries to his five. He can't do any, he will not get his Dom off. Got Truman C5 UN and an unknown. Special, yep, good play for him. Oh, it would have been nice to get D stall. I could just give Marshall here. but I don't think I want to. I think I'm inclined to get rid of it. If I hit the roll, I'll play CNS to pick up a couple of VPs. If I don't hit the roll, I'll hold CNS and use Suez to take South Africa and Libya. Yep. Yep. All right. Let's just get this event and get my VPs. Okay. Asia is a disaster, um, but uh, and uh, obviously I have no access in South America. D stalls in the is uh, in the dumpster, so that's bad. But prevented Europe domination. I've got a slight VP lead. I'm way ahead on space. Let's see if I can get an early junta. I'm gonna poke Lebanon. That's interesting. Stops my dom. I think I would have rather taken Guatemala, but okay. All right. ABM and Junta. Mm, okay, this is some garbage. Salt for D-Stall is interesting, though. But I don't want to salt until I can score Africa. I think how I learn is a good headline here. Yep, grain. No salt, please. 
missile envy. Oh, you know, event it. Well, that's too bad. Because I don't have anything good to give him. It's a bit of a reckless play on his part. <sighs> But it worked out for him. It's going to coup Africa. Get a big roll out of it. Um, if we just go, if we go to DEFCON three. Need a five or a six on that one. If I go to DEFCON 2, I could just take Dom. And maybe that's better. But if I do this, he'll coup Zimbabwe. If I don't do that, that is annoying. I think this is the play. We overprotect Zaire and go Sudan. He coups Sudan, I score Africa for two. Then I'm going to salt for destall, let chaos ensue. Oh, it was an annoying missile envy. I was annoying grain pulling missile envy. But if it had pulled pa uh, P Panama or OAS, that would have been bad too, because you could have invented that. Oh boy, those are really good events for him to have when uh, on turn two, on turn four, when I have drawn. After a scoring. I assume he, if unless he has a power card, he just coos Sudan here. Dependent reds for influence. Okay. Uh, Lebanon doesn't seem to be that important at the moment. Um, but it does stop my Dom. So, okay. I'm going to take my Africa Dom there. Okay, I don't care about space at the moment. We need to go ahead and destall. Did it destall, right? Yep. Yeah. Got my hold. I was gonna have to, oh, you know what? I was gonna have to play the China card anyway, because I don't want to give either of these yet. Stupid grain sales. Oh, 
Okay. I hate having no ops after destall, but this would, but removing him here would be really nice. I mean, Junta, what a, what a, all right, here we go. Let's get a four and neuter that, please. How about a good roll? Okay, that's a one. <sighs> Look at this hand. My goodness. My goodness me. Okay. Okay. <sighs> this is just an unbelievable dream hand. Junta, Puppets, CRGs, Grain. <sighs> oh, that is hard to deal with. That is hard to deal with. I guess I should have just de I could have just destalled and let him coup. Could have destalled the DEFCON 3. Maybe that's what I should have done with Salt in effect. But I really wasn't expecting puppets on top of Junta. What a hand. Yep, good play for him. We dare not tempt them with weakness. For only when our arms Oh my lord. Oh doubt, my. Can we be certain beyond doubt that they will never be employed? have a chance to get Libya. Okay, thank you, Latin American death, squ uh, death squads. Okay, evens up South America. I think 
was a good time to take Libya. I need to take Syria as well, but one problem at a time. Space race treating me well today. It's a good event for him. I have to prep Panama and OAS. Ooh, one small step for just a coup. I don't really care about that. He did need his mill ops. Could coup that back, but do I really care? I know, that doesn't even give me Dom because of shuttle. Never mind. Libs is coming. Maybe we can uh, some we need some power cards here in my hand okay a VP Can't OAS loses Panama, so I have to give up Sadat. I kind of don't want Panama broken. Could also take Colombia. Maybe that's better. A little brush war protection. Panama, Sadat, OAS, all in my hand early. Okay, he does break it. This hand's a little bit better.
What's my brush target? Fidel seems like a good headline. Kennedy. I think Fidel is good. Let's go with it. And there's so many bad cards that he's gonna be able to just get rid of. At least there are. At least he's dumping them on turn six and not turn seven. Lids, Central, Summit, AI, giving up our man as well. Okay. Okay. So South and Middle East are the only unscored regions. I have Middle East. Oh, wow. Going for Canada right away instead of taking Panama back. That is a surprise. Well, I will definitely take Panama back. Um, and then do I break Egypt? Let's break Egypt, see if he refills it. I'm going to try and hold defectors. Although, you know what? Holding defectors isn't that great because I have headline peak and we'll have it for a while. All right, well, 
you know, maybe I, maybe I should have spaced Norad instead of giving it up this late. But the fact that I, he took Panama, he took Canada right away instead of taking Panama back is uh, is great. And so that's a trade I will take. Good chance he's got ABM here. Oh, going China right away. So he's probably got. Okay. Yeah, he's probably got cultural. Let's do that. Might play brush for ops here. Because I definitely want to event IP war. Regardless, I want to get these wars back in the deck. Because flower power is in effect. Okay, I'm just going to play Nixon. That's a little surprising. Okay, so let's take a Middle East Dom with Brush. Argentina's not a good target. Could Brush Pakistan, but I think, I don't know, just getting these, getting this, these countries is good. I mean, these ops, I need these ops. You know what? I can't remember the last time I won a brush war. <laughs> brush war has been a source of constant heartbreak for me. So, you know what? Okay, he's got a space quag. Yep. Good for you, sir. I will take my four. Pope for Ops. Okay. Just, just a throw away. Okay, South America is coming. So can't give up OAS. He could easily have VOA here. Make my life miserable. Actually, no, I think I can leave the one in Iran. Maybe we just stop Europe Dom. Yeah, that's fine. It's a close game. I would rather be him than me, for sure. But it's a close game. Especially after this VOA, I would definitely rather be him than me. Oh, wait. Oh, what am I saying? I already got rid of VOA. So it's coming back, but it's coming back and I can't space it. Uh <sighs> 
Whoever gets ABM here, that may, may just decide the game. Okay, you sorry for the event. Okay, I mean, that sucks for me, but also that means two China card events out of the game for him. Give me ABM and cultural. Okay, I get cultural. Ugh, gunman redraw. The time are on the side of peace. All right. I think just cultural is good. Because I'm definitely eventing it anyway. And then fix, fix, fix. And he gets ABM. <sighs> he also gets help from uh, ABM also uh, helps him with NORAD. I just need him to roll poorly on this ABM. Here it comes. It's going to be in South America, I have to think. Yep. Okay. J, J for the event is not bad here. Okay. One. Two. Three. Um, I kind of want a space shuttle. No, let's not do that. Let's do one, two, three, four. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, he has the scoring. I also have a scoring. Okay, now we're at discard, which is good. All right, I'm gonna five-year plan OAS. Jesus. 
Look at those cards, my goodness. At least he's got to give Korean War under flower power, which sets up a potential war game situation. Yeah, Benelux, okay. I need my mill ops anyway, so let's just get them. The close game. Five year plan could just do so much more harm than good. Plus, I, I have no way of dealing with OAS. I mean, I could, I could play China and discard it, but that doesn't seem good. Realign Nigeria. Influence. Oh, okay. Thought he might just try realignments, which might have been a better play, but a jam is good too. But surely one such lesson learned by the world at great cost is that aggression unopposed becomes a contagious disease. Independent Reds is annoying. That's annoying. I guess it's Marine Barracks to just counter that. I guess I'm going to discard independent reds. Um, the other thing I could do is I could I could headline Yuri and Samantha. Because I think we're going to have some a coup war in Africa. We might have a coup war in Africa this turn. Maybe Yuri and Samantha's good. And if he coos, that puts me in a good position for war games. That that if you know if he's if he doesn't have it. All right, let's do that. Chernobyl's a free three ops on AR7, but, oh man, I kind of want to try for those VPs. 
Then again, if I get the VPs, I can't space duck. But then again, duck is gone. I can't space teardown. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, you gotta just take a coup. And give me a VP. Yep. How about that? Uh, I don't know about giving China though. No, because if he can just realign Nigeria, that's fine. Let's just repair that. So he's gonna wanna, he's gonna wanna get another one into that year. So I'm gonna coup. Oh well, he's gonna wanna get arms race off. Okay. All right, let's get a coup off in Cameroon. Or, no, let's get a coup off in Cameroon. Yep, good for him. Let's do that. Okay. Third time's the charm? Third time is the charm. That's big. That is big. Okay, uh, another VP for me. And we are now going to be going over protect, over protect, over protect, because I do not want to get an Asian battleground poked and have Dom scored on me. And Chernobyl, I guess I'm going to space. I mean, he still's got, we will bury you. Do something to annoy him. Maybe I should just overprotect stuff. Because of stupid NORAD. <sighs> Saudi's not that important. If he wants to spend all the ops to flip it, he can. Three IP wars. Three of them. Five. 
finally hit on the third one. Okay, board looks much better now, but it's nowhere near over. Especially with grain and voice around and me not able to space either one. Latin American debt crisis to discard, we will bury you. Okay, nice play. Yep, that's, I, that is a good play too. I believe that communism is another sad, bizarre chapter in human history. There's war games, which is nice. Last pages even now are being written. And Aldrich. War games should be good enough here. Um, but Europe scoring in the headline would be very bad. Although, no, Europe scoring is only, only five. Okay, missile envy. He's going to get Cal. So I think, so he's gonna get Cal and two VPs. So I will have to wait now to lay R2 to play war games. So let's play Aldrich and see what he has. Okay. Um, I don't think there's anything here that's gonna stop war games, but let's just make sure there's no, he doesn't have anything that's gonna attack my hand. Yeah, he doesn't have anything that can attack my hand, other than obviously Missile Envy. Man, that IP war. Man, that IP war. He's thinking hard, but it's not going to matter. Surprised he didn't invent that. But all right, we'll be back and forth game. Um, that turn one was real bad uh, for me, but Asia didn't come out till turn three, uh, and then it hasn't come out again. And I finally, finally won an IP war. Um, I was able to neutralize uh, the turn three Europe Dom, so I didn't actually give up any points in Europe. I uh, got a central dom off. South went for even. I didn't have to throw that ridiculous turn four hand. I got an Africa dom. Um, he, he, I don't think he should have let me get away with this Africa dom that I got. Um, and then Space Race was very kind to me. I, 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 I missed, I think, one roll all day. Uh, so that was, uh, that was great, too. Uh, but that puts me at nine and three on this OTSL season. So puts me in a good, good shape to make the playoffs. Um, and... Uh, two more games to go. Um, 
so just but very very good uh yeah Okay, everyone. So just chatting with my opponent a little bit. Um, but thanks, everybody, for tuning in. I uh, appreciate you watching. Um, next game uh, is going to be Thursday evening. Uh, we've got a team game. Uh, Ted and I will be taking on uh, Michael Panateri and Kevin Goody, uh, D.C. versus Nevada. When, uh, and if we can win that one, we'll go to 2-1 and one in group play, be in good shape to advance. If we don't, we'll be 1-2 and two and need a win against Colorado and some help beyond that. Uh, in order to uh, make it to the next round. So it's a big game for us. Uh, I'm looking forward to that one. Hope you'll join us then. But until next time, this is Justin Abramson. That was fun, but now it's done. So long, everybody.